And what's us here now is Greg Manchas, one of the top artists in the field. Uh, Greg, uh, I understand you're working on a book. Yeah, I did a painting a number of years ago that people asked me what it was about. Uh, There's a guy going up a mountain with a bunch of polar bears, pack animals, and uh, I started making stuff up. And a friend of mine said, "You got to get that to a publisher." And six years later, uh, in learning how to write, it's going to be a book, fully illustrated, uh, paintings on every page, about 230 pages. It's a lot of painting. Yes, it is. Uh, and what's the book about? Uh, it's about this main character, but it's he's now a 17-year-old uh, uh, airship pilot, and he's searching for his father, who's an explorer, and he's lost in the frozen waste, and he's it's uh, dependent upon him to go find him, and as he does, he tends to find himself. So, okay. Um, one other thing is on tour.com. You've kind of partnered with Michael Swanwick with his short works and your paintings for them. Uh, how does that work? Well, Irene asked me if I'd be interested in these short stories, Irene Gallo, and, uh, and I thought this would be a great opportunity to work on uh, paintings that were more montage-like because were, the settings were moving all over the place. And uh, after I read the first story, I was hooked. And she said, well, that's good, because there's going to be like a string of these. And so uh, every one is just intriguing to me. And, and uh, Michael's writing is just fabulous on this series. I, I hope it just skyrockets, because I think everybody's going to love it. But Because uh, he, he wants to do a longer uh, application of the stories. But each one is a gem. And uh, the, the paintings I try to make gem-like as well, with a lot of color and, and all that. So I'm loving that. Great, thanks.